you look at your traditions and you go and read Bukhari, it's very, very clear in Bukhari that Uthman burnt the text. Now, if you read about the history of Uthman, Uthman was assassinated. If you read about the history of Ali, he was assassinated. This sounds like more like a film called The Godfather than a religion, right? Listen, so, so you've got these kind of Godfather mafiosa things happening while the Quran's being compilated. So how can you trust the Quran being compilated when it's all this political assassination going on? How do we know that they've not doctored the text? But Uthman burnt the other text. And when he burnt the other text, when he burnt the other text, I can't and you can't prove your truth right or wrong. I can't prove you right or wrong because you burnt the text, you burnt the evidence. If an atheist says to me the Bible's changed, we have 5,000 ancient manuscripts to show them that the Bible's not changed. But you, wait a minute, you went and burnt the text. The text had been burnt and we can't check it. But we do have manuscripts, we have the Sinai manuscript. There is no manuscript in existence today in an ancient Quranic manuscript, and I'll challenge get any Muslim apologist to challenge me right now. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish the Let me finish. Let me finish. There is no, no, you go and get any Muslim apologist now to refute this. I'll wait while you go and get them. We have the Sana manuscripts and we have many ancient manuscripts, right? We don't have one ancient manuscript that has all the verses in the Quran. Did you know that? So, so, here, so sorry, sorry about that, sorry. So here's the point. Here's the point. You have to do textual criticism. You have to get, let me finish, let me finish. You have to get the ancient Qurans, the Sinai manuscripts and other Qurans, and you have to do textual criticism. So this argument that you're making is not a good argument. Until you have scholars that get the ancient manuscripts and do textual criticism, this is a, a false argument, it's a bogus argument, it's a lie until you do the scholarship. And guess what? If you read the Cambridge Companion to the Quran, and there are Muslim scholars in it, they say there, the scholars, that there has never ever been a textual, uh, rend a textual compilation of the Quran. In other words, the scholars in the world have never got together, looked at the ancient text of the Quran and made one Quran. The why is and why? Number one, scholars, scholars, if they challenge the prevailing view, lose their job in the Islamic world. Number two, Number two, scholars are not allowed to go and check the manuscripts. If they do, they have to wait years. They have to wait years. They have to wait years. Please don't film me. Don't they have, they have, you're making they have claims, you're you're making claims that you're not you supporting. Rubbish. You're just saying anything. So, Please don't. don't so we've rubbish. got, we've rubbish. got, let, let, look, look, let me rehearse. When you, when you claim, let me finish. You bring a proof. If you've got evidence, yeah, you, you can refute it. Look, look. That's Let me finish. That's, 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 Let me finish. How many Bibles do you have? Let me finish. Why don't we question this with evidence? We've got one Quran and we're trying to question it, and you've got how many versions do you have? She made a good argument. How many different Bibles do you have? You've been very smart. The, the argument was, your argument was, your argument was, because you could not find the bones. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. Just chill out. Chill out. Chill out. Just chill out. Just chill out. Take a chill pill. chill pill? Because you are. Right. Let me do the argument. I'll do three. Let me finish. Something just and you up. cannot back it up. That just is your lying. Just just lying. And, 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 and if you don't play. back up, you're a liar. You back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Let me finish. Let me finish. No, no, you give me a speech. Let me finish. You're attacking me as a person. You're attacking me as a person. Yes, you are. Let me rehearse the argument. Here's my evidence. 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 In Bukhari, read Uthman. Uthman burnt the text. One by one by one that is in Bukhari. Now. You can yeah, check it, now. right? Okay. Number two, right? Check the Sana manuscript and see if all the verses are in the Sana manuscript. I checked it. Listen, I checked it with the Muslim scholars. I went on Muslim websites. I checked it on Orientalist. Every scholar that I've checked, there are not all the verses in. I'm not saying it's been corrupted, but I'm saying not all the verses are there. Right? Number three. Number three. Have you checked with Muslim scholars? Yeah, I checked. I checked Mansour and his website and other scholars. Yeah, you say scholar, yeah? Let me, finish, let me finish and then we have I'll come I'll come back so I'll just let, let me third, third argument third, third argument scholars you look at the scholars today that criticize the Quran most of them do it not using their real name they hide the 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 name so the Quran we have now fourthly there are many Shia scholars, Muslim scholars, that say there are verses missing in the Quran. 
So, yeah, so your Sunni, but there's a group no, no, of Muslims, we're Muslim. we're Muslim. there are Muslims they're Shia. that disagree with no, you. No, 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 forget and that. Finally, yes, forget that. No, 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 Uthman was one man who was the head of the caliphate and he and had Ali. many people and rebel Ali, against him no, no, no. and he Omar got assassinated. assassinated. He didn't, that uh, never happened with the Bible. The yes. Bible never What's had one man make the Bible because the Bible was not made by one man. It was made by God and, it made, and God made it accepted in the ancient world because no committee or one man That's got together, claim. not so one man or so committee lame. said so that this lame. is the Bible. No committee did so that. So you're saying we don't so have the Quran? Lame. You're attacking I'm me as sorry. a person. No, no, you, Stick to the you, argument. No, no. I'm, I'm sticking so, to so the what argument. What's the point then? You My point is, have... where's the bones? You yeah. don't have the bones. Yeah, exactly. What's the point? The Explain bones of the Quran, us. there's no evidence that the Quran has ever been passed on. You don't have the skins, the bones, you don't have nothing to show us. So, so is it only written, so except for one verse, is it only written on the bone? It can't be written on a bone, on a paper, on a, on a skin? Show us the paper, show us yeah. the bone, show us no, the skin. No, why? Why do I have to show you three if one is existing? Show us a bone. Why, why do I have to show you? You ain't got no evidence. Excuse me, so the Quran that we have now, what do you want that that, 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 no, that is Uthman's dissension. That is, the Quran, yeah? that is not the Quran, no. That is a very sad news you're giving yeah. to the people. That's the truth, bro. Completely an Islamic Je news. Jesus said, heaven and earth will pass away. Sad, have, you noticed, sorry, excuse, have you excuse, noticed the Muslims are melting now. away? Hello, they were finish. packed. It was let packed me, with Muslims. Let me now you've had me finish. And now the Muslims yeah, are melting yeah, away. You're rude now. Yeah, when you say let me finish, I let you finish. If you're a Christian and you come and to give untruthful news about Islam, it's not fair. If you're here trying to teach Christianity, I would, I would accept it, even if, if, even if you're wrong about it, I'd say maybe he doesn't know enough. But you're a Christian, not knowledgeable at all, and he comes to teach us about it, about the Quran, it, it's, you're a little bit behind. Yeah, yeah. Okay. He's preaching, basically. Now, I was preaching, right? Wait a second. I was preaching, yeah. and then Muslims came to me. Uncle Jamal, no, sir, Uncle Jamal came to me, yeah? And many Muslims came to me, and that's how we got to it. So, so I didn't start it. Sir. I, wait, wait, I was preaching from the Bible, okay? Number one. And number two, I have a degree from Manchester University in theology, right? I've studied I, live, I lived in Manchester, I think I've Manchester studied, I studied Islam at A, a level, at MA level. Sorry. I've, I've been there, I lived right next to the university. What I've seen from the students, I'm illiterate, I studied Islam at MA level. So, what I'm telling you is, what I'm telling you is, you don't have any evidence at all to back up your position. This pastor guy is critiquing Manchester University. Oh, is it there? Get degrees. <laughs> He's qualifications are as a bus driver. I'm sorry, but my opinion, my opinion. He's one of the great British universities. The point is, the point is, universities is just a financial base to move much further. Let me finish. You have no evidence to prove that the Quran that you have today is the Quran today. You burnt the evidence. You don't have the bones. You don't have the skins. The scholars can't look at the manuscripts. They lose the job. And if they do do the no, 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 scholarship. No, 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 no. If they do do the scholarship, it's right. jihad. Right. They lose the right. Let me say something. So, wait a minute. So, wait a minute. So, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You just said something. In our talk. universities, no, you no, no. use skeptical scholars like Bart Ehrman against us. You don't have skeptical scholars on your side because you kill them. The Islamic world killed them. No, maybe it's secret service and the No, they killed them. No, no, how come? You don't have Muslims here. You don't have Muslims here. Why can't they do what you're saying? Your Muslim world does not have free speech. It's, it's hate speech. You don't have free speech. You're, you're hate preaching. In Islamic world, please, you do not have free speech. Don't film me, please. In the Islamic yeah, world, you do not have free speech. Yeah, but don't film me. Salman yeah, Rushdie. But I have the right as well. So Sal it's, 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 sir, okay, Salman Rushdie. There's an example of a man who criticized Islam and had a fatwa put on him. You don't have free speech in the Islamic world. And Muslim scholars, if they criticize the Quran, they'll lose the job and they could even lose their life. That's why scholars write books criticizing the Quran, changing the names. So they haven't got the scholarship, basically the one-on-one -on -one scholarship, the Cambridge Com Companion to the Quran, the most prestigious piece of work on the Quran says this, that there has never been a textual edition of the Quran ever made. 
There's never been a proper scholarly edition of the Quran made. You do not do textual criticism. We have textual criticism, and we've been doing it for hundreds of years. We're honest about what we do. We don't burn the evidence, and we don't kill our scholars. We have opportunities to discuss and debate. Well, what happened here, I was preaching, then Uncle Jamal came in a crowd. A crowd, excuse, a crowd, a crowd started to uh, shout me down. So then I asked about the bones. They say the Quran has been passed on from Angel Gabriel to Muhammad, Muhammad, two companions, and then it was written on bones. And all I'm asking is for the historical evidence for these bones. And they haven't had them. And what we've seen today is loads of Muslims here, and then they've run away. We've had some of the top debaters. We've got one here. We've got Paul Williams here. They don't want to engage with us because they're scared. Where's the bones, Paul? I'm scared of him. Very scared. Where's the bones of the Quran? No idea. No idea. He admits it. Was the Quran revealed on sticks and stones and bones? Good question. Was it revealed on sticks and stones and bones? Good question. Was it? I don't know. Intellectual dishonesty. Here's one of the best debaters, and he can't debate to help himself. That's the intellectual dishonesty. He likes to debate the Trinity, but he can't debate on textual criticism of the Quran. One last question. Paul, Paul, did Uthman burn the Quran? Did Uthman burn the Quran? I don't know. I don't know. He did. What's the point? Ah, oh, he knows the answer. He knows the answer. See, this guy debates every week, Cornish Christians every week, and now he's cornered. He don't want to debate. This is one of their best. He's debated Rowan Williams, and he won't debate me now on the textual criticism of the Quran. That's their scholarship. They're cowards. They pick on Christians every week who don't know the stuff. And when you come here with stuff, the scholarship on their Quran, they don't debate you. That's their cowardness, yeah? Amen. Amen. I, they, you, listen. Why did Uthman burn the Quran? The, the Muslims say why the why. I'm asking you. I, I, I'm, Muslim. I'm going with the Muslims. I'm going with the Muslims. The Muslims, the Muslims say there was different. The Muslims say there was different methods of pronunciation, right? Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Right? You ask the question. It, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Take a chill pill and relax. Take a chill pill. Just take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. Right? If an atheist comes to me, says the Bible's changed, we're open and honest. 5,000 ancient manuscripts of the New Testament. Here they are. Have a look. Right? But if I burn them, Atheist, well, let, excuse me, let me, let me finish, 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 let me finish. An atheist comes to me, I burnt my text, Bible's changed. Where, where I can't prove it. I'll tell you why you burn it. You burn it because it's an embarrassment to you. You burn it because you're hiding the evidence. That's why you're burning it. You're burning it because, because, I tell you this, did you know Uthman, did you know Uthman was assassinated? Uthman is the one that made the Quran today. He was assassinated. After Uthman, Ali was assassinated. Did you know Muhammad? He was assassinated. He was poisoned. Now, now, I like The Godfather, the movie. You know The Godfather, the Italians? They bump each other off. That's what it's like in Islam. Muhammad gets bumped off. Ali gets bumped off. Uthman gets bumped off. It's like The Godfather. It's like The Godfather. And that is who you're trusting with your Quran? It's like the Mafia, folks. You can't trust. You can't trust this Quran stuff in the Muslim world. You can't trust it. These people, these people were fighting each other. There was politics involved when, those Quran, when that Quran was made. So the Quran that you have today is a political manufacture of the Sunni. That is what the Quran is. The Quran is a my friend. The Quran is a political manufacture of the Sunnis. It's a political production. It's not come from any angel. Let me ask you something. Let me say. Let me ask you something. What eyewitness do you have? Somebody who was standing and saw the angel Gabriel speak to Muhammad. What eyewitness do you have? You have the companion of the prophet. Name me. Name me one eyewitness. Name me one eyewitness who was in the cave. What is your point? We have companions created the voice of the revealed. People have their life, their biographies, their character preserved. So what's the point? That is the point. Here's the point. In the Quran, in the Quran it says, Muhammad cannot forget. Right? Listen, listen, listen. In the Quran, it says, Muhammad cannot forget. 
In the same verse, in the same verse, in the same verse, let's verse. We'll get him over here. Well, forget him. Tell me what's I've got a bag here. No, no forget the bag. You, you, quoted it. you quoted it. They can prove me if I'm wrong. Give me your number. Just move. Move out of the way. Move out of the way. Move out of the way. Just move out of the way. Just chill out. Chill out. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. Right? There is a verse in the Quran that says the Prophet Muhammad. The Prophet Muhammad will remember everything, right? Same verse says, but Allah will make him forget. That is schizophrenic. That is schizophrenic. That is dishonesty. Which verse? Now, if 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 I quote something, I'll give you a reference. Let me see this page number. Let me see this Listen, if you want page number, I've got stacks of, no, no, of, of well, scholarship there. Stacks of scholarship. Oh, something like now, here's the point. Here's the point. There is no point. Here's the point. You quote I love you, bro. I love you, bro. Here's some fun. Here's some. Here's some references for you. Here's your Bukhari volume six. You want, hey, hang on, hang on, hang on, you want to give me some scholarship, bro? No, 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 no. Don't touch. Don't touch. Don't touch. Don't touch. Don't touch me. Yeah. We can get the Quran. We can get the Quran. Did you pass me that bag? I'm asking for Quran. I get the Quran. Chill out. No. Chill out. We got the foot. We got the scholarship, bro. He's talking about the Quran. Hey, bro. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. We got the scholarship here, bro. Give me a hug. Do you love me, bro? Do you love me, bro? Yes, do you love me, bro? Yes, I do. I said, do you love me, bro? Give me a hug, bro. Yeah? We got the scholarship here, bro. Now let me read some of these hadiths. Bukhari, volume 6, 61, 556. Five, I'll tell you what they're about. So Bukhari, volume 6, 61, 513. Muhammad requested dev seven different ways, versions to pronounce the Quran. Do you know what that means? No, 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 no. no. Seven different variants. Did Seven the different variants. Did the meaning change? No, no, no. This is what I call the mafiosa of the Islamic world. Right? It's the mafia. It's the mafiosi of the Muhammad. You know, listen, right? I pronounce a Quran. Stand here. Stand here. I pronounce the Quran. I pronounce the Quran. Yeah. Listen, I pronounce the Quran, and there are seven different mistakes. So what I do is, God told me there are seven different ways to pronounce it. Hey, that's a good one, isn't it? Eh? It's seven different variants, not seven different ways, guys. You've been blinded by this prophet. He ain't no prophet, all right? He ain't no prophet. You've got no eyewitnesses who saw the cave and, and Mohammed in the cave with the angel. You've got no bones. You've got no skins. You've got no sticks. You've got no evidence. You've got a prophet who forgets. You've got a prophet who can't even memorize. You've got a prophet. You've got a prophet. Listen. You've got a prophet. You got a prophet. You got a prophet. You got a prophet. Will you just pass me that? We we pass me that bag there. There's a Quran in there. I've got a Quran in my bag. I've got a Quran. I've got the Quran. I've got the Quran here. He can't distinguish between the Quran and Hadith. No, he's not. I've been here five minutes. Nothing. Not even a verse. Not even a verse. Come on, struggle. Get out. Come on. I got the Quran here, bro. I got the Quran. Give me that, give me that, give me that. You're going to get the Quran reference now, bro. It's coming to you, bro. You still ain't give me a hug, bro. We've travelled from Nottingham today. Yeah. So we're quite tired. So you've been travelling about with the truth. If I was more active, I'd rip you, mate. Quran 33, 37, what does that say? 337, that's what it says. Bring it up, man. Do you know what that says? 337? Mohammed, Mohammed fancied his adopted daughter's wife. Adopted. Adopted son. He fancied his adopted son's wife. Mohammed fancied he liked, he lusted after his. Adopted sons. What? Really there? Through 33, 37. Well, you need to go and get one then, bro. This is my Quran. No, 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 no. This is a very special Quran. This is a Jason Burns Quran. <laughs> you need the Uthman Quran. This is the Jason Burns Quran. I have Shia verses in here. 
you need the Uthman Quran, I've got the Shia Sunni Quran, meaning it's Sunni and I put in Shia. Yeah? So this is the Jason Burns Quran, you get your own Quran. Now, he lost it after his adopted son's wife. So the Quran. Wait, can you read that for me? Quran, 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 Quran says, says just chill out. Take a chill. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. Just take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. Let me finish. Do not display yourselves. So the Quran, listen, let me finish. Hold on. Just don't be aggressive. Just chill. 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 Mate, listen, you quoted a verse. Just chill. Read it. Just chill. Just chill. Just chill. Just take a chill. Just take a chill pill. Just take a chill pill. Now, here's the point. Here's the point. How are you doing? Have you made up your mind yet who you are, the Christian or the Muslim? Or not? Are you a Christian today? Confused.com. Confused.com, isn't it? What are you today? A Muslim? Seventh day Adventist? You are confused.com for us. Today? Tomorrow you'll be in the Seventh day Adventist. Next week you'll be a Muslim. That was corrupted. Next week you'll be a Muslim. I thought Christianity would teach you love. The week after that. How can you be so hatred towards a human being? He's a hate preacher. I thought, oh, Jason, you are a gentleman. Yeah, you're a hate preacher. Are you a hate preacher? He said, he said, oh, you, what are you? He said, what are you? Are you a confused, said, confused said, com? He said, he said, take a chill, Bill. No, no, you're a hate preacher. You're a hate preacher. You Jason, know, I thought you're a gentleman. Oh, I love you, bro. You came all the way from Manchester. Give me a hug. He said, he said, he said, just take a chill. Give me a hug, brother. No, give me a hug, I like you. I like you. You are you are a gentleman. But he's not right, though. Scoff off. Jesus, Jesus was a prophet. A prophet. Prophet. He's a prophet. Matthew chapter 21, Matthew chapter 21, verse 10 to 11. Matthew chapter 21, verse 21. Come on, come on. Matthew chapter 21, verse 10. No, I'll shake your hand. I'll shake your hand. Can you help me out? 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 Is it true to say that Muhammad married his adopted son's wife? He's a hate preacher, hate preacher, hate preacher, preacher, man. Prove it. You're sick, you're sick, you know you're sick. You're sick, you're sick. You're attacking me as a person. Well, are you ready? Uh, uh, let me ask you another question. Let me ask you, let me ask you this question. Was a man approved of God? Let me ask you this question. Are you ready? I'm going to read this. Surah, are you ready? Surah. Which one are you reading? Just chill out. Which, Which Quran are you reading? The Jason Burns Quran. No, you are. The you get a Quran. Quran. Which, it's Which, better than the Uthman Quran. It's not. You're you, lying, man. Listen, listen. Let's talk about the Bible. Let's listen. Let's listen. talk about the Bible. Are you ready? What is your Aramaic? What, 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 what is your Aramaic Bible? What is your Aramaic Bible? Just chill out. What is the Aramaic Bible? Chill out. Chill out. Tell me. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Tell me what the Are you ready for this? Let me read it. Let me read it. I'll read it. Do you read Arabic? If I read this, do you read Arabic? Listen. I'll read it. I'll read it, and then you can come in. Because I want to. I want to learn from your vast scholarship. I want to learn, oh, there's another one over there. Adnan, 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 I've got a question for you. Why? No, I'm fine. Oh, I saw a man. Come on, bro. I, I'm one running away. Uh, bro, what question, bro? I'll answer. What's the question? What question? No, Adnan. Why are you scared of us? The ship of the Muslims here outweigh us. This, no, what it is, the scared. No. No, he, he, listen, Jason doesn't know. Jason comes. Scared about debating the Quran. I'm going to go and ask him. I'm going to go and ask him. No, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. We just, we just doing one thing at the moment, man. Calm down. Calm down. Let me ask a question. Jason, you're not his level. You know when the Quran was revealed? Was it revealed on sticks and stones and bones? No. Was it written on sticks and stones and bones? It was written on different things, yes. Yeah. Was it written on bones? Yes. Yeah. Uh, do we have any of these bones today? No. Okay, no evidence. That's all we want, bro. Jason, God bless Jason, you. Jason, Jason, this is all this. Jason. God bless you. God bless you. That's so good. Flawless. No evidence. You want a black? You want a black? Thank you. Want a black? <laughs> you, want a black? Thank you. <laughs> so, what we just seen is they've got no historical evidence for the Quran being made and passed on. And there's one of, we've had two of their best scholars and they're not willing to engage with me. They're picking on young Christians every week. They could have picked me down, but they've not chosen to because they're scared. They're scared, yeah? Here it is, Surah 3.3, Surah 2.101, Surah 3.23, Surah 5.44, Surah 2.53, Surah 21.48, Surah 2.87. 
Now, the first three verses there talk about the Quran has been, the Bible has been twisted, the Torah and the Injil. But the rest of the verses say that the, Bi that the Quran, uh, the Bible, the Injil and the Torah is a light, a guidance and been preserved. And there's contradiction here. In the Quran it says, read the Injil, read the Torah, it's a guidance. And then in their Islamic tradition, they're saying that the Torah has been corrupted and the Injil has been corrupted. It's a contradiction. How can the Torah and the Injil be a light if it's been corrupted? There's a contradiction there in their system. These Muslims are not honest, they're not truthful, and they're not honest about their position. They need to be honest. They won't debate me. They won't debate me. They won't debate. God bless you. So my name is Jason. We're here to share the gospel. We're here to share the life of Jesus. Jesus wants to bring us life, not religion, but life. At the woman at the well, he said, drink, drink of living water, drink of joy, drink of peace in Jesus. Know the love of God in your life. Know the Holy Spirit in your life and come to know him as your Lord and Savior. God bless you.